If you are in search of custom ROM for Redmi Note 4G, that is HM Note, then you are at the right place. I am gonna show you the best custom ROM for Redmi Note 4G that is stable and really good. So by the way, I am NK from NK's Gaming Tech. Let's start the video. <laughs> I found this stable no good custom ROM for the Redmi 4G that's a uh, old Redmi Note 4G HM Note okay uh, I was searching for some custom ROMs for this I was not getting stable and some official where I could get nightly updates for that one they were unofficial but I was not happy with those for those people who are searching for a best now get custom ROM for your Redmi Note 4G that is HM Note then this is the perfect place I have the mocky custom ROM for you so how you can download it you just need to go for mockyos.com where you can find the 90 ROMs for that and you can just flash it so camera was pretty decent in this one I mean it was almost the same that we will get with the stock ROM uh, both the front camera and the rear camera I was using the footage camera applications uh, because uh, it's easy to just change the settings and I was just got used to it. Uh, you can just uh, switch between the 4 is to 3 and 16 is to 9 ratio with both front and uh, rear camera. The flash was working fine and the video camera was uh, taking about 1080p rear camera and 720p for the front facing camera. And you can change the audio source with this application. But let's have a check on the stock uh, camera that we can we just do it. And uh, I was uh, oh, hey, I, I was seeing that camera was performing good, good with the footage camera. But let's see with the stock. You know the stock was uh, is the same. Even I love the stock of the camera. Uh, I don't say it's not well. It's uh, not so good. It's really good. See, you can have so many options like changing the ISO and everything. And this uh, photo was taken in that phone in the outdoor condition. It was great. So. It, the, I can I will say the quality of the camera is decent by the phone itself not for the uh, custom mode. and I see the music you get some stock uh, music app that's like almost a lineage the one you get with the lineage one it's almost the same and I just like it you are you had this crazy equalizer with you and the music uh, app is nice as you can see the animation and that circle thing pause play buttons all was actually very good placement I just like it and uh, you can just set some more things as your convenience in the settings menu so the stock camera apps were amazing like some more we get like a mocky center mocky center uh, is the application where you can check your updates for your phone whether it be a nightly update I don't think uh, unofficial version may have this but the official version has this uh, checker where you can check for uh, the updates and, and uh, more things and this is another application I think this application is like a greenify to save your camera but I'm not sure but if you know about this just please uh, write down in the comment box down below this is an amazing application now this was it for the monkey actually I like it the ROM is stable there is no problem battery backup is really nice uh, I was getting about a one day battery and uh, that another thing is uh, I use the pixel filter application I yeah your phone is uh, five and a half inch big and uh, it's uh, uh, 720p resolution and it's pretty nice everything was good and clear and I use a pixel filter uh, for getting a, a bit more bit more uh, battery so this was uh, let's see as you can see the pixel filter it just filtered the most of the pixels and this is like a my RAM management it was also good it uh, the apps doesn't take a long time to get booted up it was uh, good and the gaming performance on this phone was also nice uh, you may ask uh, do the custom ROMs just to spoil the gaming experience no they don't uh, I don't know about the unofficial big I will try some more ROMs for this phone I need to find some I found this one for just now Oh, but gaming performance with this ROM is uh, similar to the stock ROM. It's decent and uh, I say it's smooth. The gaming experience was smooth. Not uh, it didn't just mess up the things with uh, any sort of lags or anything uh, with giving you a long loading time. 
I see it was uh, very fine. Thanks for watching my video, guys.